Hi, I'm Michael Nadlin from Market Lead, and today's video is about target CPA and how your data is actually held at an account level, not at a campaign level. So this is a bigger misunderstanding across a lot of specialists and a lot of businesses. I know this because a week ago, I still believe that the data was held at a campaign level. But my experience showed that when I was splitting our campaigns and I kept the settings the same, the target CPA or the maximized conversion goal always seemed to go really well immediately. But then on other accounts, it didn't. I was on a group coaching call with Ed Leak last week, part of the Forge group, and he actually gave an answer to this that I'd never heard. And it's actually that the conversion data is actually held at an account level. But the reason why most people's campaigns fail is because when they're duplicating campaigns or changing their variables being ads, keywords, they're actually changing the settings. Now, the results that they're achieving in one campaign with a target CPA goal are based on many things, including budget, target CPA goal, and other settings in there. But most of the times when people duplicate it out, they don't just make the changes on the ads or the keywords, they actually make the changes on the settings as well. And that's why most of the time it fails. But if you're wanting to actually make changes on those campaigns, execute this in a way where you duplicate it, all the settings are the same, and then get to that point where you're getting about 20, 30 to 50 conversions in that campaign over a 30 day period or longer. And that way, then you can start making adjustments within there because the conversion data or the data based on the user is actually held on an account level. But then when you execute in the campaigns, and the reason why it mostly fails is because people are making settings changes. It's not that the data is bad or the keywords or the ads are wrong, it's that the actual settings on the campaign are not aligned with previous data. So all you gotta do is duplicate a campaign, you can split campaigns out now, know that the data is gonna be held on an account level, but when you do change the settings, you're actually changing the algorithm and how the algorithm will look for new high intent buying prospects. Now, you know what time it is. I'll keep this short. Like, comment, and subscribe to keep uh, up to date with the latest and greatest Google Ads and paid ad news. And lastly, it's your time to be number one. So Market Lead is now taking on new clients. So if you're serious about increasing sales, increasing customers, and more importantly, scaling your business, book in a strategy session with someone in my team and you'll get a free action plan. Just go to marketlead.com.au, go to the strategy session link, and then book it in there. So remember, like, comment, and subscribe. I'll keep this short. Enjoy. I'll keep this video short, but I just wanted to put this video together because I noticed that this is something that I tend to go really well in, in some accounts and other accounts they failed. And now I actually had a definition or a reason why this was happening. So remember, like, comment, subscribe. Enjoy.